Even as a child, Jeff Hodling was curious about how things worked. I took everything apart. I wanted to see how it worked. I got a new toy. I didn't care to play with it. I took it apart and never got back together. Manufacturing gives you opportunities to not only take things apart, but to problem solve and put things back together again. In manufacturing, there's always something that comes up that you need to, to work on. Uh, each, each day, there's a new challenge. Just the, the sense of how machines work, how you can make it better, how you can make things easier, how you can make things faster, it definitely puts a, puts a sense of pride into yourself. At Becton Dickinson, a leader in biomedical manufacturing, understanding what makes things work and how to improve the process is what manufacturing is all about. We manufacture 42 million syringes a week, which is just over 2 billion a year. There's over 25,000 associates worldwide. Uh, over 50 production facilities. We work in a very clean environment. We make medical devices that help save uh, people's lives. And uh, it's, it's an environment that, that is very challenging. We, in the Integra Department, specialize in a retractable safety syringe. And we, we mold all our components here and we assemble um, on site. We mold everything with our injection mold presses and then our assembly machines take those components and put them all together and package it. And we also sterilize it. Today a lot of the technology lies in computers. Um, all of our assembly equipment is software driven. Um, the machine operators actually have to know how to run the program, the software, and interact with a touch screen. They touch the screen and make the machine do different things and the machine actually puts all the components together. Today we're going to do maintenance on uh, all the machines except for molding. We're going to have the assembly machines down and I need um, Scott and Paula and Ben to be on assembly today. My typical day in the morning I have a shift startup meeting with my personnel to decide on what's running, if there was any concerns or quality issues that the team had on the shift before any machine reliability problems that we need to address and after that I have to do production reports um, to let the plant manager know exactly what we produce for the day where are we on target on inventories um, sometimes I have to do payroll once a week Connecticut's economy is dependent on manufacturing in fact in today's new manufacturing companies are looking for highly skilled technical workers we do have a shortage of higher technical uh, skills uh, in, in our area and that when I mean by high technical skills people that can troubleshoot equipment and make repairs with the right education there are plenty of opportunities for young men and women in today's manufacturing I have an associate's degree and I'm going to be an engineer in this facility hopefully someday there's plenty of opportunities for all associates that uh, want to better themselves they we have we have a tuition reimbursement plan that pays hundred percent reimbursement for people that get a C plus or better. Uh, we have in-house training programs that are available to all associates. Uh, we also have team-based uh, training. The benefits are excellent. The most important thing for me, obviously, is to come to work in a safe, healthy environment, to be able to go home to my family and provide for them. Biotechnology manufacturing could be just what you're looking for, the opportunity to create a bright future for yourself while making a good living. An added bonus is knowing that you're making a difference with the products you make. When I come to work, not only do I get a sense of pride in trying to learn or strive to make the machines better, but I know that the, the product that's coming off the line, going in the package and going out the back door, is going to go to a hospital, to somebody sick, or somebody that needs something as far as medication goes and that I'm contributing to helping that person live a better life.